Why'd you decide to grow the hair back out? <laughs> Just one of those things, like I cut it, then I'll let it grow for a couple years, and then I'll cut it again, but just a personal thing. Now, the last year had a little up and down year. W when did you maybe feel like that you weren't right? And eventually I know you went on the shelf, but maybe when did you feel that maybe it was time to maybe take some time away? Um, so I first started kind of feeling not right after the Texas Tech game and just kind of was doing stuff in the training room rehab and trying to be, get better. And there were days that I felt good and days that I felt worse, but that's the Auburn game last year was when I was knew there was something that was probably time to get something looked at. And how do you feel today? Perfect, perfect. Parker, what excites you about the staff this year? The pitching staff? Uh, I think that the depth of it, that, I like seeing that. I like there are guys that I feel like there's guys that are more open to doing whatever role that they're told to do rather than having something set in stone in their head or something like that. So seeing guys that are willing to work with coaches and do things like that really excites me. When you had those back-to-back -back games, they get like 20-something strikeouts in a week or whatever it was. I mean, what was working for you last year during that stretch with Texas Tech and I, I forget who the other team was that you had in that same Princeton. week, Princeton? Um, I was really able to throw my breaking ball whenever I wanted to, just in any count really for a strike wherever I wanted to. And uh, so I felt like my biggest struggle last year was throwing fastballs for strikes more than throwing a breaking ball for a strike. And so kind of whenever that, I couldn't throw that and a fastball for a strike, then I wasn't throwing any strikes. So I think that was something that really helped me out. How you big better. is it to have Luke back in that captain role? Uh, I love that guy. So he's one of my roommates. I've played with him since I was 13. and. I think he's a guy that every clubhouse would like to have around, just the experience that he's had and the type of guy that he is. I think everyone really enjoys him being here. You've had a variety of roles since you've been here. Uh, you know, kind of what's your focus this spring and what do you anticipate your role being? Um, I've kind of worked as a starter in the fall, but also relieved in the fall, but not close in the fall too. So it's whatever they tell me to do, I'm willing to do it. I guess what's, what do you kind of tell maybe some of those younger guys about you know coming into a program like this and knowing that you know, like you just said there there could be various roles you know you gotta kind of step in wherever you're put. Uh, that's everyone that's recruited here is mainly a starter in high school or at their junior college or wherever. So most of the time going in the bullpen or coming out of the bullpen, it's the first time for everyone doing that. So it's just to find your routine, get comfortable with it, and stick with whatever works. With the bullpen issues last year, and there was a lot of stress put on the starters. How much more confident are you in the bullpen now that, hey, I can go six innings and turn this thing over and the game be over? Uh, a lot. There's, since there's guys that want to be down there and they're not pissed that they're not starting, I think that that kind of lets you be on the or in the dugout watching those guys throw and you're a little bit more comfortable.